friends today i am here with a very simple program that is average of an n numbers i have selected this program specially to cal to show you very basic fundamental concept this is a very important program and a very fundamental concept you will get a clear if you do this program at your own don't copy my code take my code as just for a help okay i will upload this code on my blogspot but you should do it at your own okay see friends what is the average average is nothing but the sum of numbers divided by the total numbers see this formula is used to calculate the average now if i consider five numbers then sum of numbers divided by the five is nothing but the average see friend this is a very simple program i am mentioning here friends i am i am mentioned integer variables and num as array and i num array is used to store the numbers which insert which will give which will be accepted from the users okay this 10 should be greater than the numbers the user should insert you can take a 10 100 100 anything but if you take in 100 then mention it long end okay see how many then from users you will take that numbers how many numbers and store it as an n n okay then from users you will this sum is not don't consider this sum here just initialize to zero okay let's consider then you are requesting user to enter all the numbers and store that numbers in a num array okay in memory now this is this simple very simple sum is used very simple logic is used for the summation so for first iteration sum equal to zero and num zero then sum will be nothing but the num one for second iteration sum will become num zero and n- this will become num one num zero plus num one will store in a sum now for third second iteration sum will be num zero plus num one it will be num two then this way you will get addition of the n numbers now average is nothing but the sum divided by n here i have mentioned m but that is not necessary this i have just mentioned to show you what kind of errors you will get if you mention here that is a percentage d then it will definitely show the errors what errors it will show it will show that you have mentioned sum as an float variable at first time why you are showing it as an integer d is used for integer if you remember if you read the book read the book then you will get that see i have mentioned sum here as a float and i am requesting at output sum as an percentage this will be very common error that will come from a perfect programmer also so to to become a perfect fluency in c you should you should consider on these small small errors okay and here i mentioned the average of percentage d number is a percentage of here also if you mention here a percentage d then you will, will get error one more thing someone would have got what if I have given all number as an integer, and if I mention this sum as an integer, then will it show the correct result? With this formula, definitely it will not show the correct result because C is not the language which is defined by the group of people. C is the language which is defined by an individual. So that individual have given some rules. C. I will show you one rule that given by C individual. This is a rule given in a C book. if you do the addition of if you do the division of a two integer then it will show result zero while if you make it as a float then it will show your correct result so that to get correct result of a division a one number should be float okay this is clear now let's go for the program practically friends see here i have mentioned same thing here same integers average you float scanning you and here i am showing finally the result this is just in my block plot name okay control f9 let us do what kind of every after printing mistake enter four number so enter the number 1 plus 2 plus 3 4 2.5 4 in our next time i will give number as an l1 will it show the correct result yeah definitely it will show 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 11 see this will be the correct answer of your but if you mention here 12 well, then it will show the wrong answer
this is your answer because that n that sum equal to 10 this thing this thing is getting overrated okay friends so if you want to code program if you want this program then visit my blog spot and for more programming skills like my videos and post the comments bye